before now was, uh, she was a pastor, she's still a pastor, but she was a very active pastor, um, always going to visit members in the hospital, or going to schools, going to courthouses to, to, to assist members where their sons or daughters had trial dates, um, going to care about her children and grandchildren. She was always in that big old suburban on the road going to take care of somebody else always and um i i know i was just i'm often like mother just relax they're okay you can call them no they need to see my face so that she was very active always taking care of everybody and when we received the diagnosis which is god has just given us a miracle the doctor said uh, she has kidney disease stage five, and we're giving her four days, 10 days at most to live. And um, her decision was to not do dialysis. She just didn't want to have that type of routine in her life. She witnessed my dad go through it, and it was very difficult to um, witness that for her and for us, and she just didn't want to do it. So we, we just chose not to do it and believe God. So here we are um, now, a year later, after they said 10 days at most, and uh, we're still here. I knew that there was no way that she could be blessed with this beautiful home and not enjoy it to the fullest. Mm. I, I want you to be able to go upstairs or downstairs as often as you want to because this is your blessing. Mm -hmm. You need to enjoy this blessing. So that's how we ended up, we were watching TV one day and I saw the commercial for Acorn Stair Lift. I said, you know what, let's call him. So when the, when the gentleman came to do, give us the estimate and everything, uh, she looked over at me and started crying. And she was like, you would do, you want to do this for me? Mm -hmm. I said, you would do it for anybody else? For years she mm -hmm. has given of herself endlessly, tirelessly to so many people. Mm -hmm. And it's time for her to get it back. Well, they, he doing it, yes ma'am. Thought that was on my, my new step today. Yes ma'am, it just be the new stair lift, yeah. It's no struggle, no pain, no, nothing. No, nothing. yeah. She would, she would have anxieties about those two steps. And now it just, it was so hard. Yeah. It was so hard to do, could to manage. Yeah. I never would have thought I'd have been like going up and down with that. Yeah. But y'all made it possible. Yeah. I thank God for you. Thank you. She's an amazing woman. <laughs> um, for years, I, I never understood someone who gave so much of themselves until they had nothing left for themselves. And being a woman, a, a modern woman, you it's like, no, I need something for me. You just, you kind of have that mentality. And um, for so many years, mm -hmm. I foolishly did not want to be like her. Mm because she always gave, gave, gave. And it's like, now what do you have for yourself? But having to take care of her, it's like she has really shown me what love is. I don't know what I was doing for 46 years. It wasn't love. 
the way she has taught me to love is just, it's unimaginable. I, I can imagine that half of the world is not loving the way we're supposed to be mm. loving. Because I will go to bed at night exhausted, but feeling good knowing that she had a good day. You know, knowing that she had something as simple as a bath. <laughs> You know, <laughs> something as simple as her favorite meal or I was able to clip her toenails or file her fingernails. It's like, I'm okay. I'm exhausted, but yes. if she's all right, I'm good. You know, yeah, you get tired. Yeah, you get exhausted, but it's okay because it's for her. <laughs> and she did it for so many years for my dad, for us, for the members of her congregation, for their friends. <laughs> for her grandchildren, for her grandchildren's friends, for everybody, for the community. Yeah, this, what I, what I do is nothing compared to the eight, I know you're, you didn't do it as a child, but at least for the 75 years that she did it for everybody else. She means the world, and I didn't realize that until I was about to lose her. She helps me. I, I told I the told, Lord, Lord, I can't, I got too many. How can I help to take care of my children now? I can't do nothing. The Lord said, you, they gonna do for you. He said, you fail, but you fail into the hands of nine daughters. He said, they gonna take care of and that's what Matrice and my girls have been doing. Every now and then we all need mm -hmm. some assistance. Mm -hmm. Just a little help. And it doesn't mean that you can't, you're, 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 up, you're aging or anything like that. Um, for, us, for, for us, it was just helping her to have a quality life. Mm -hmm. Not feeling like this is the end, but this is just the beginning of a new way of enjoying life. As a, as a caregiver, it has been super beneficial because I can get her back and forth to her, appointment, uh, to her appointments with ease. Mm -hmm. Before the stair lift, mm -hmm. we would talk about it the night before, mm -hmm. and I would see just the angst in her, in her eyes and even in the conversation. Now, well, how are we gonna do this? Well, we're gonna do it like this, and we're gonna take our time, and you know, we just have to get up a little, a little earlier to, you know, get you down. So I won't be tired, and so you won't give up. You know, it was just all of that mm -hmm. planning the night before, but now it's like, okay, we just—it's just—it's like any other day. Mm -hmm. It's giving her her life back without feeling like something is wrong with her. I felt like a, a, a brand new person. Mm -hmm. I'm on that water just a while ago. Yeah. And just riding. Uh, and then you said it's going to turn around. Right. And then I didn't know, who, uh, oh God, that was just a blessing. Yes. And it turned around. This was a, I don't know, I could have, I made it but doubt it, but I thank God that I do have it. Right. And it's going to be hard for somebody to try to take right. it from me. Right. <laughs> And I'll, go ahead. This is mm -hmm. wonderful. And now I got a house, and now I don't have to worry how to get up, up and, and down, down the steps. steps. And even something as simple. Oh, it's so wonderful. I know earlier I said it was something as simple. Things we take for granted, mm -hmm. just being able to take a shower. Oh, yeah. The first time, for, for months, we were thoroughly just doing yes. these really great wash-ups. Yes. But I knew that, you know, every now and then she would ask, you think mm -hmm. I could take a bath today? So we have a tub here, but it wasn't like the shower upstairs. So when we first got the stair lift in and was able to give her her first shower, wow. she just laid in bed that night and was like, oh, I feel like a brand new person. It just felt good. I did, you did, I did. <laughs> I feel wonderful. Yeah. So it helps me to care for her even better knowing that she's had a shower or I was able to shampoo her hair and she's feeling good about mm -hmm. it. 
It's worth it. It's a blessing. <laughs> And anybody planning on buying it, please go and do it. Yeah. Hurry up and get it in your house. You can't miss it. Yeah. And somebody, I, I, 81 years old, I believe. Yes, you are. <laughs> and I think one thing about it, they could have got it yeah, for you last yeah. two years ago, but I what it would be. <laughs> but I am happy. Hey, right. thank God that he touched somebody's heart. Yeah. And somebody gave, and I got steps up there. Mm -hmm. That's I, I, wonderful. I think it's a freeing thing to realize when you need help and you need assistance mm -hmm. and not worry about what other people are thinking about you needing that help or assistance. Mm -hmm. It's bondage when you're worried about what your friends are going to think or what people are going to think. Free I, yourself if you need the assistance. I don't. You just need the assistance. I don't worry. Right. I'm just looking for people. I'm looking for a better way. Yes. And a better way has come. Yeah. <laughs> and I thank God for it. A better way is here. And thank God for you all. I do. It's it's amazing to show up today to to find out what was going on and that we were going to be doing that for for her was just absolutely amazing. And then, you know, to have her ride it and, you know, the emotions and everything, the smiles and, you know, that she doesn't have to go up the, those two steps. That was such a challenge. It's, it's great. It was, makes me really proud to, to work for a company that'll, that'll do that. Um, you know, and it just, today was one of the best experiences I've had with the company in 12 years. So that was, that was amazing.